Johnny, I thought they got you back there. Jesus, are you shot? God, what happened? Oh, Jesus, oh, Lord, Bonnie, what happened? Oh, my God, D. Darling, what happened to you? Your face, her face, Bonnie. It doesn't matter now, Leland. She's dead. We've got to move on. We can't stay here. I know, but just give me a minute. Tell me what happened. She came out of nowhere. I thought she was one of them. I, I didn't see her until she was right there. You did this? You did this to my D? I don't... I don't believe this. I don't understand. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Leland. Bonnie. Go back this way! Oh, I no, feel sick. You're going? Which way? There! I'm sorry to do this to you, darling. Leave you here. Call out if you see him. Way. We can't stay here forever. I think I saw something over here. They went this way. What the hell are you doing? She's gonna die for this thing. I for damn sure ain't leaving it behind. There are survivors out here. Still alive? Oh, they're gonna be happy to get rescued. So how many are we talking about? Around five, I think. They left a note, so at least we know they want to be found. And I can see smoke in the distance. Probably a camp. I'm gonna try to make contact tonight. Great. Well, just be careful and use your best judgment. We're building a good community here. We want to keep it that way. Of course. So good. I'm gonna try to talk to him. Wish me luck. Yeah, good luck. Be careful. Don't try to force him into anything. Just get as many of them as you can. We should probably split up two. You got it. Hey! Don't shit! Don't fucking move! Who the fuck are you? My name is Tavia. How did you find us? I found your note. I'm a scout for a growing settlement up north. We go out and look for survivors to rescue them. We have food, clean water, and shelter for everyone. We're offering you a chance to help us out and start over. God, this sounds too good to be true, but I think it is. Bonnie, get real. Just because you have to tell the truth all the time doesn't mean everyone else does. If I didn't trust people, I'd be dead. I know that for sure. People can care about you if you let them. Like Leland cared when he let you run off alone? That's enough, Becca. Guys, look. If I learned one thing from Danny, it's that we have to stick together and protect ourselves. What? That guy was an asshole. You should be happy he got killed before Shell and Becca joined us. Why? Don't worry about it. Yeah, screw this. We don't know what kind of people we're dealing with. The only reason I'm with you guys is because Vince saved my life. Look, we need people, plain and simple. You folks can decide if you want to come as a group or split up or whatever. But I don't want to be out here in the open after dark. So in a few minutes, I'm going to be getting back in my car and on my way. Hopefully, at least some of you will follow me. 
Chell, why are we even listening to her? She's obviously lying. Even if she's not, I think it's better to just keep on the move. Staying in one place makes you an easy target. I don't care how safe you think it is. That truck stop was a death trap. It was right off the highway, for God's sake. No way you and a bunch of sick old people were going to defend it. I don't like this, guys. We should just walk away. I don't trust her. Of course you don't, Russell. You don't trust anyone. What will it take to convince you? I don't know. Russell, come on. Oh, come on, guys. I mean, we left those photos so that someone could find us, didn't we? Well, it could be a trap. What if they want to kill us? Thank you. Everyone out there is batshit crazy. We've all seen it. Well, we turned out all right, didn't we? Relatively speaking. If we wanted to kill you, you'd be dead already. I had a gun and snuck right up. Well, what's stopping you? Exactly. Nothing. Look, I know you guys are wary, and you have every right to be. You don't know me from a hole in the ground. And yeah, there are some crazy fuckers out there. All I'm here to do is make an offer. You can come with me, or you can stay here. The choice is yours. So, who wants to come with me? I'm just not sure. We've been out here for so long and seen so much bullshit. I mean, is it really worth getting our hopes up? Of course it is, Russell. Hope is all we've got left. But being smart, that's what's keeping us alive. It's a safe place for everyone. Criminal activity isn't tolerated within our walls, period. You don't have to worry about bandits or walkers or anyone else. We look out for each other. We understand. I think we've all made up our minds. Well, I guess we have our group. What do you want to do with these? This is a good thing. I know it is. How do we know this will work out? You don't. All right. <clears throat> so Danny or Justin, whose foot did you shoot off? <laughs> Me and 70% of players shot Justin's foot off. Stay or go, did you stay in the car or get out? You and 50% of the players got out of the car. Left Nate, did you leave Nate or stay with him? You and 75% of the players left Nate. Liar, did you lie to Leland? You and 25% of the players were honest. <laughs> Kill Stephanie... Uh, did you leave in the RV or kill Stephanie? Me and 25% of the players killed Stephanie. With those percentages, it looks like, you know, four people have played this. <laughs> Interesting. So, one person left with Tavia, and everyone else stayed at the camp. Yeah. Huh. Well, that was interesting, I guess. I don't know. I don't know if... I guess there's only one person's story I need to change in order for everybody to stay. Um, but, I don't know. Eh, it's kind of like little short stories that really just didn't end into something, I guess. I mean, if I saw what the camp was like or something additionally, which I still might. I mean, possibly, I guess. I don't know. But, so yeah, that would be 400 days later. 
interesting kind of interweaving story, I guess. He saw bits and pieces of the other people's stories. And then, like, the one group was talking about Vernon stealing the boat and then them breaking up after that. So, yeah, it's interesting. I don't know, there's like a million little choices in these stories that, like, could dramatically alter everything. So, yeah, it's kind of interesting, but not really that much fun, I guess. <laughs> not compared to the main story, because, like, every time I'm even somewhat slightly invested in one of these characters, it's like, oh, it's over. Okay. And, yeah. Not too much going on with this. But, it's done! So, uh, I guess if that's it, I really appreciate you guys watching, and we'll see you next time.